Hello, good people. Hi, I'm back with another Target haul on this beautiful weekend, or should I say the weekend was amazing. So how's everybody doing? Hope everyone's doing well, considering the circumstances that we are living in. I'm just at a loss for words. I won't get into it because you know, it's very sad, it's very depressing. Um, I just pray the day that we seek change, um, if there even is a such thing at this point. Um, but I don't know, I'm really at a loss for words. So I just ran to Target um, not too long ago. Um, I was able to find someone to do my nails, so I'm so excited. Um, it's been, I'm not even going to blame this on COVID to keep it 100. I haven't had my nails, in, well, I'm sorry, I haven't had my toes done, mainly my pedicure. I really don't too much do my nails that much because I don't wear, wear gel polish or like the dip. I only get a pedicure. I've always been like that. Um, I think I've had my nails like that fake stuff on my nails, like when I went to prom, <laughs> and that's been decades ago. I'm almost 40 years old, so I, um, yeah, no. But I got me a little pedicure today. I mainly went to get my, um, I'm sorry, I got me a manicure and a pedicure, so um, I haven't had my toes done. This is so embarrassing. I wanna say, mm, it's been a minute. It's been before COVID. Yeah, it's been a it's been a nice minute. So she did a really good job. So I'm really excited um, about that. I was happy about that. That was earlier this morning. I went to her like around. My appointment was four. I thought my appointment was four, actually ten. And then I looked on my phone and I had it saved and it was actually for, I put 11, but actually she said it was for 11.30, so I don't know. But I got them done. She was amazing. And yeah, so I went to Target. And I, and I have to remember that Target is on a new time schedule since this COVID thing. They close now at, do they close at eight or nine? They close at nine. Yeah, they close at nine o'clock. Yes. So I have to remember that. But real quick, we're gonna go over some things that I got from Target. Hold tight. Let me get my drink, okay? sparkling ice they are so good oh my goodness anything lemon i like they have like a a lime one. Oh my god it was so good yeah these are my new favorite this is good but i picked this up ew where did this hair come from you guys my hair sheds all over the place. I hope no one ever does anything to me because my hair will be all over the place. So, um, sparkling ice, really, really good. So, some things I picked up from Target. Excited about this. This is the OG. I didn't, I don't even, uh, let me get my thoughts together. I haven't seen the Jergens original scent cherry almond since my grandmother used to get it back in the day. Oh my God, when I saw this, I was so excited. Um, I had to pick this up. This brings me back to my childhood. Growing up, going over my grandmom's house, cause she will always have all the good, bad, bad things. And I think that's where I get like my, um, like soaking in the tub and things like that. I just know my grandmother used to do things like that. Like she would like soak in the tub and she would have like her different soaps, her different bath um, soaks and all that. 
So that's where I get that from. And she used to buy this. And when I saw this, I had to get it. And it smells so good. I love almonds and I love cherry. And that combination mixed together is just amazing. So I'm, I'm sure everyone knows about the original scent cherry almond that Jergens has. Oh my God, I cannot stop smelling this. I cannot wait to soak in the tub and tub or shower and just put this all over my body and just relax. It smells just like cherry almonds. Yeah, so I picked this up from Target. This, I was really excited about this. I just picked up the small one um, because, oh my God, this mosquitoes. I don't like mosquitoes. They are annoying to me. So yes, I picked up the Jergens Cherry Almond Lotion. So yes. Um, also, I picked up some Mrs. Myers cleaning surface cleaning, multi-surface cleaner. So yeah, I picked that up as well. Um, I picked up some Dove soap from Target. Um, I like Dove, I like the way it smells. I never smelled this scent before. It's the mango butter. So I'm excited about that. I can't wait to try that. So I picked that up. Um, a little beauty, um, Thing, I mean packet that I picked up was this sweet chef kale vitamin B sheet mask I can't wait to try this you guys have you if you guys haven't tried um, sweet chef please try it it's a, it's at Target um, it's really really good really good stuff please um, try it try it out really good and it's a good price point as well um, I picked up some vinegar. <laughs> um, I wanted to get the big one because I use this for everything. I even throw a little bit of this when I wash my clothes, um, when I wash my work uniform. So yes, I use this and I got the really big one um, this time. So I'm excited about this. Oh, I don't know what happened there. My um, phone is going low per usual. So yes, I picked this up. It's just a big um, bottle of vinegar. Okay. Let me put this away. We're not saving any bag. Also, what I picked up from Target was... Um, I never tried their Good and Gather brand, um, but I was out of salad dressing and I saw that this was um, on sale two for five. So I picked up the Everything Season Ranch dressing. So yes, um, I'm gonna start um, getting back to my calorie counting um, and throw in some, you know, some exercise. So I really don't like to get into fitness because um, so it can be a sensitive topic. Um, everybody body is different. Um, you have some people who don't have to work out that just can eat right and their body looks amazing. You have some people that can eat anything and they don't gain a pound. Um, you have some people that have to constantly work out just to keep their shape or maintain their weight um weight and fitness it's really a touchy subject so i really don't want to get into it too heavy because i am not a nutritionist nor am i a doctor nor am i a, um a personal trainer so what may work for me may not work for you what may work for you know, someone else may not work for you. Everybody is different. Um, so that's all I'm gonna say about that. But yes, um, I picked this up and this was two for five. Um, oh my God, trash bags are so expensive. So I picked up some trash bags and this is the um, Glade Sweets 
citron and lime and it smells so good y'all oh my god i was so excited about this as well i've been eyeing this cookie jar so yes and i love cookies <laughs> so i finally went ahead and pulled the plug i've been eyeing this cookie jar for about two months now like yeah real real talk what's going on with my hair right there mm. what is that why is it so puffy right there I don't know, but you guys see that? Oh, it's probably, maybe I was sweating really bad in that area. Oh my goodness. Woo. It was so nice, but it was hot today. So I picked up this cookie jar and I'm excited about my cookie jar. I can't wait to get my cookies in there. And I've been eyeing this for like about two, two months. And I've been trying, but I've been eyeing it. I want it to go down. I've been waiting for it to go down in price. I mean, it was only $16.99. But, I mean, I only wanted to pay like $9, $9 for it. But it never went down. And I was there today. And I was like, Paula, just buy the cookie jar. And every time I go, every time I would go and see it, it would be like one left. And I was like, you know what? I was scanning it because you know I have the Target app. So I would scan it, and I will be like, it's still $16.99. I'm not buying this. Every time I would go, I would do the same thing every time. Until today, I just pulled the plug. I was like, you know what? Forget it. I'll get it. And again, it was only one left. So, And I know it's probably online, but... So, yeah. My receipt. I also picked up some cooking oil. So got that nothing exciting about that like i said i like fried food i still fry my food it's all in how you cook it i don't eat it every day it's like a treat to me i like fried chicken i like catfish nuggets <laughs> so yes um oh my god so i saw these mini nan um flatbreads and I said this would be good for me to make me like a little personal pizza and you get it say you get four one two three yeah you get four in here so this would be so good for me to make like um a pizza so yes that's why I picked these up I'm excited about that um I also picked up a eyebrow um kit because um so i get hair i'm not a hairy person but i get hair in the most ugly form i'm speaking for myself i don't like it i get hair here because my mom does i get hair here and um i'm starting to get it here as well um and it makes me very uncomfortable. People that know me, you know, they'd be like, oh my God, you can't even see it. It's not that bad. But for me, it's very uncomfortable. I don't like it. Um, I don't know. It makes me feel a certain kind of way. Um, I know they say, you know, just try to like it or try to grow into it. But I just can't. It does something to me. It just makes me feel weird. Um, and I get everything threaded so i keep my eyebrows threaded and don't mind my eyebrows they have not nothing's been open so and they're still not open where i go um i get my eyebrows threaded i get this threaded and i get this threaded. this isn't that bad and this is this is just starting and it's really not that bad but i notice it but this is a beard if i let it grow because my hair grows pretty fast um and i started taking like vitamins and you know that only enhances growth depending on what kind of vitamins you take and i am taking like vitamins for um healthy nails um hair growth and all that so it grows really long and it grows thick um and it's so weird because i have weird hair my hair isn't i don't have like that thick nice hair um i have nice hair but it's not thick but at the same time it is thick it's so weird but 
I noticed that when this grows, it's thick. Um, so I don't like it at all. So yeah, that's a pet peeve of mine. Um, so um, I've been playing. I've been playing with the idea for a really long time of getting it. Um, what's what is it? Lace is it not LASIK is for your eyes. Um, I can't think of it right now, but I'm sure you guys know what I'm speaking of. Um, and more than likely I will get that done because it's, it makes me feel very uncomfortable. I just, this right here, this I really don't mind, but this I don't like it. It's, it's ugly to me. It, it, it's so ugly to me. Um, so yeah, so anywho, I picked this up for my eyebrows because I needed like an eyebrow kit. Because I actually started like the other day, I like plucked a, a little bit of it under here and it, I didn't do too bad, but I don't want to mess around with my eyebrows because I really like the girl that does them and she keeps them thick for me. She keeps them, she keeps the shape. So I'm not going to touch on that too much. Um, put my glasses back on because I'm over here front like I, like I can see. Also, I picked up some hangers. Am I the only one who like these hangers? I love these hangers because it keeps your clothes intact. You don't have to worry about it falling off and things of that nature. So I picked this up. Also, I wanted to share, get these bags out the way. We're not saving any bags. Um, I wanted to share um, something else that I got. And it's back to like, um, I guess beauty, weight loss, or whatever. So, um, I am about to, because I have cellulite in my legs and in my booty. So, I wanted to get something for it. And I would see the soap and glory. And I know this has been around for a long time. I know a lot of people talk about like the bum bum cream at like Sephora. And I think they have their own website. But I'm not ready to try that stuff out yet because that really hasn't been around a long time. I know people brag about the smell. Um, but I know this has been around for a really long time, the soap and glory. And this is the super intense sit tight. And um, I read the reviews. And again, this is another item that I've been going to Target or Walmart and just looking at it and not getting it. So I finally pulled the plug today and I picked it up. So I'm going to be putting this on when I go for my walks. So I'm excited about using this. So yeah. And this is the Soap and Glory Sit Tight Super Intense 4D. Um, it's pretty expensive for a I mean, I don't want to say for what it is because I haven't, I never used it. So I don't know how good it's going to work, but it was, um, 20 bucks, like 21, um, 2099. So yeah. So I'm excited about using this and that's all I have. Um, things that I am excited about. So I am excited that I picked this up, the Jergens Original Scent Cherry Almond. You have to go out and get this. It smells so bomb, so, so bomb. I'm excited to start using my um, Sit Tight Super Intense Firm and Smooth and Body Serum from Soap and Glory. And I'm excited about my cookie jar because I've been eyeing this for about two months. So I'm excited. Um, little things make me happy. I don't know. I've always been that way. So um, I'm excited about that. And yeah, that's it. So this is going to be bye for now. And I will see you next time. Everyone stay safe. Make sure you are calling your loved ones and letting them know that you love them. And that's going to be it for now. Peace.